Raw copper ore is striking enough on its own, with its blue and green tints. Earliest copper items in Europe were probably made in the East, with the earliest large-scale mine discovered in present-day Bulgaria, dating to around 5100 BC. From there, it was then imported to other parts. Soon, others started to build their own crucibles and process the metal. It is believed that most often copper items were symbols of power and status, and were intended for a narrow circle of users. Metal products were of finer quality, proving more resistant, flexible, versatile, and less brittle than implements of stone, wood, bone or antler. Metal can take many different shapes and forms and, if damaged, it could be re-smelted and used again. The forging houses were most often placed outside of the settlements. This could be attributed to their respected status and the danger of fire and poison gases. When melting and extracting copper from pyrite ore, a dangerous arsenic gas is released. Even a small amount can cause major damage to the nervous system, 